Hi everybody, it's Alejandra with the Osceola Library System and welcome to this month's Take and Make where we'll be making pom-pom coasters. Take and Make kits are available one week prior to this live program, so if you had a chance to pick up a kit, you can go ahead and follow along with me with the supplies included. If not, the only supplies you're going to need for this craft are some just some blank cork coasters, some strong glue, I'm going to use E6000, but you can use hot glue or whatever glue you prefer, and a whole lot of pom-poms. So, once you have your all your supplies gathered, we can go ahead and get started. Okay, here we have our project close up. It's super, super cute and not difficult at all to, to do. So, I have my cork circle here. You can go ahead and paint it if you want. That would be really cute too. The ones that come with your take and make kit do have a adhesive on them so you just need to peel the film off and it is a bit sticky as you can see but you, you would still need to use some glue to make sure that these don't come off so you can go ahead and just put a generous amount of glue on your first little pom-pom and just stick it right in the center and then you're just going to want to vary the colors as you go and glue them very very close together so there's no space at all And this would be this would even be a fun craft for for your teen if you have a teen at home. It's fun. It's cute. It doesn't require very many materials. And I can make one of these in about I would say 15, 15 ish minutes. So not very time consuming either. And it does take about. I'm gonna say about 80 to 90 little little pom-poms like these to completely fill up one, one of these regular circles. And I'll just continue gluing and placing my pom-poms so they're nice and centered. So you can see there, I went around and then you're pretty much just gonna to continue to go around in circles and circles until you've completely filled up the entire cork circle. Okay, and I am using E6000, which is um, waterproof. So I did have someone ask me about that, if this would be okay to put a condom, like a wet beverage on top of, oops. And I have, I put my water bottle on top of this and it was perfectly fine. You know, like it didn't, it didn't ruin it. So I would say go ahead and opt for like a, water, a waterproof glue, just to make sure that you don't um, ruin it with any moisture okay so I'm not gonna go I'm not gonna glue the entire thing if I don't want to be here for the whole 15 minutes but that's what you're gonna end up with as your end result thanks so much for joining me everybody as a reminder our next crafting live program is gonna be February 3rd at 2 p.m. where I'll be teaching you how to make a floral monogram letter Make sure you check out our website, osceolalibrary.org, for more information about our crafty live programs and our other services. Thanks so much and see you next time.